All right, we got a home light to 240. I got this all for free and I'm gonna give it a try today. I know the tuning's off. The low was really lean the first time I started it. So we'll see if we can get it tuned up and cutting well. Alrighty. runner she does have an issue though i got the chain good and sharp we got bar issues uh i noticed the chain was extremely bad and i fixed the chain but i never touched the bar see that We gotta do some work to the bar. I think once that's done, it'll be a good cutter. Ooh. Ooh. Charlie horse on the side. But uh, I'm gonna have to take the safety tip off. For my kind of work, it doesn't work for me, you know. I'll have to take it off. But other than that, I think if I fix that bar up, I'll be good to go. Maybe I'll show you how I do bars. You wanna see how I clean up a bar? It's, uh, it's definitely some out of the box thinking. Uh, 
maybe we'll do a, do a video on how I clean up my bars. Now, as far as my opinion goes on this 240, sitting right here. They are a good saw. Just in a little bit of running I did, I can tell it's gonna be a good runner. Uh, they're a little finicky on, finicky on the tuning. Like little adjustments make big changes. But as long as you can get through that, you know, if you get, your, if you get the opportunity to get it, definitely. Uh, just a quick update here, although, on the, uh, the Home Lights 360. I gave it a try today and it would not start. Uh, well, I shouldn't say that. It started and ran for maybe three or four seconds and it was really lean. Uh, I've been playing with a metering lever and I think it is just a smidge too low right now. Uh, just a smidge. The, uh, the 360 seems to be one of those saws that is very finicky about the tuning. And I think part of that is the carburetor. Very, but it was definitely lean those few seconds I had it running. It, it literally just a couple of seconds and uh, I couldn't get it to, I mean, I, I, I bring full choke, full throttle and just yanked on it and I never got to the point that it was flooded. Maybe a pop here and there, but that's it. So I definitely think it's lean. I'll probably just have to tweak that metering lever just a, a hair higher. Uh, whenever I said it the last time, I thought it might have been just a little too low. And it ended up running but i think it ran because of me flooding it so many times in a row it had enough fuel in there to get it going you know what i mean but then after i got that all burned off it just it went i mean even the last time you saw it running it went lean and shut off on me so we're almost there once we get this carburetor sorted out we'll, we'll have a runner uh, it'll get there one of these days, but that's it for today. So until next time, I'll see you.